Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I truly appreciate your love and support. Taurus, today we are going to do your career and finance reading as I haven't done it uh, for a while, in a while. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. All right, Taurus, spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate finance and career, career messages for Taurus. Taurus, for this reading, um, I set my intention to, towards the end of this year, 2021, but for each and every one of you, your divine timing is different, all right? Please bear that in mind. So we've got the Ten of Wands and we've got the King of Swords here in reverse. I feel like a lot of you are not talking about how hard it is. You're just taking one step at a time with the Ten of Wands here, just trying to persevere through the struggles or the difficulties right now that you could be facing. Eight of Pentacles here may indicate you're working really hard regardless of focusing, regardless on trying to uh, achieve something. That's what I'm getting. With the Hierophant here in reverse, to, to me, the Hierophant in reverse can indicate the government, okay, or an, an organization. With it being in reverse, that means, you know, something may have happened. I feel like this is happening to a lot of people in the world. Um, it could be anything, an organization, government, uh, with the king of swords here in reverse also can indicate somebody abusing their power. But whatever the case is, uh, Taurus, you're still persevering through, you're still doing your best to, you know, take it one step at a time. Uh, and also with the Eight of Pentacles just working really hard and justice is also in reverse here. So this is not fair. There are things that are not being done to you fairly you may not feel like this is fair in general and we've got the eight of swords here you may feel really stuck like i can't do anything right now right feeling really really stuck justice and reverse also can indicate legal issues or legal situation that makes you feel really stuck and that you can't do anything right now but you're still trying to i would uh, i can see that just either focusing on yourself or focusing on your hobby or focusing on still trying to do something okay we've got the two of cups here in reverse seven of swords in reverse yeah a lot of you are feeling really really stuck with the world here in reverse some of you you may be stuck because of this is just for a very small group of you okay you may be stuck in a situation because you are in a love situation you, either you're in a marriage or in a relationship that could have make you feel may, that may have made you feel like you're stuck and that you can't um, do something that you want to do, okay? It uh, could be because of financial reasons, just for some of you only, okay? But the Two of Cups here in reverse may indicate a partnership that I feel whether you're, you're stuck with a partner, whether it's a love partner, an actual business partner, or a co-worker that you're not very happy about, that you don't have a choice but just, you know, stay, because of that, because the world is in reverse here, so stuck. It's definitely stuck energy here. You want to start over, but you feel like you can't right now, okay, for whatever reason. There could be some obstacles, some restrictions. We've got the Seven of Swords here in reverse. Let's see more. So Nine of Pentacles is in reverse. Whether it's you codepending on somebody for money, or that there are people or somebody whom is codepending on you in terms of uh, finances, okay? Uh, with the Nine of Pentacles here in my first full of swords, I feel like you're just doing your best to be as chill as possible, hoping and praying with the full of swords. Also, you could be strategizing, you could be planning, planning for your exit. That's what I'm getting. For a lot of you, it could be, yeah, you could be trying to plan for your exit, yeah. So we've got the Nine of Wands here in reverse and a magician. I feel like some of you are going to play dumb or trying to play like, oh, I don't know. Oh, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I'm getting that message. It's so funny. It's just going to play dumb like, oh, I don't know. Or play. Um, that's a sense where either like a bit, it's almost like you're using your weaknesses 
to your advantage. I hope that makes sense to you, okay? I don't know why I'm getting that. I keep looking at the nine of wands here in reverse. Because the seven of swords in reverse can indicate somebody whom is very sneaky. Whether it's you being sneaky or somebody being sneaky around you, okay? But I feel like if this is you, Taurus, so you're just, your, your way of sneakiness is like sort of like, hey, like I'm not that capable or that sort of like playing dumb a little bit towards your advantage okay but actually it's premeditated with the four swords here like you you, you are planning it that you've been planning to do that because we got the magician here so but taurus if this is somebody whom is scamming you trying to scam you okay just be careful okay um anything that looks too good to be true with the magician here because somebody may put a false mask on and they're gonna make things look so glitter glittery you know so good to a point that you know that you won't be able to resist it that's another storyline that i'm getting but the magician could also indicate this is your plan this may be your plan your plan may come into fruition and this is why i feel like perhaps some of you you may act or behave like you don't have much but actually you've got a plan to exit or to do something okay for your own benefits and with the magician here, I feel hmm, this could be you utilizing your skills, okay, as well. Manifesting, planning something, definitely planning something, okay. A lot going on in your head right now. I definitely can see that. Yeah, there needs to be a transformation with the death card here. Some of you may be leaving somebody or a corporation or leaving your business uh, or a job, okay. And I feel like you're starting to make something happen with the magician here. But <laughs> the magician is also a con man, okay? So maybe, who knows, just be careful if somebody's trying to con you. Or maybe you're, you're thinking about conning somebody, I'm just kidding. Who knows, but don't get mad at me for saying that. But five of swords is in reverse here. And five of pentacles is in reverse. Hmm. So that's 5-5. Five, five. If you guys like check out your angel number 55, there could be some messages for you over there. But what I'm seeing here is also 5 pentacles in reverse may indicate um, if it's not right position, I'll be a bit more worried. But when it's in reverse, I feel like a lot of you are trying to, um, what's that word again, improve your finances, okay? Uh, this may also indicate improvement in finances in general. Five of Swords in reverse. I feel like a lot of you may put an end to a past career, past job. This has already happened. I feel the Empress here finally. So whatever your plan is, plan of exit or plan of going into something, it looks like it's going to be a good plan. The Empress is right here, so it looks like it's going to be really successful and you're going to be really abundant. And there is growth as well, all right? And it looks like you're going to be very comfortable with your finances or your career. Some of you, you may never even have to work. Empress, look at her. She's just sitting down. <laughs> She's just sitting down and collecting money. For some of you, maybe. That's, that's your scenario. For some of you, maybe it's you working really hard because that's the Eight of Pentacles here. And finally, you can kind of rest with the Empress here. All right, Taurus rest but still receiving money okay taurus this is your reading i hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm going to leave you with four videos on the screen right now these are the videos from my second vlog channel if you guys are interested to check it out and also i'm now open for personal reading bookings if you guys would like to book me information is in the description box below if nothing else i hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading take care bye taurus